What's going on? Steph back with another video. And this is my reaction to winning with women. Mr. God jokes, never beg a woman to come back. All right. And, you know, when I was listening to that video, as I was driving, I couldn't really watch it. Uh, when I was listening to it, man, I was just like, yo, the boy Mystic is on point with it. Right? He, he's, he's, uh, he's very on point with it because, you know, from what I see, and even still, you, even with a woman you just talking to, you like, or, you know, you like what you want to smash because she got that booty behind her. Uh, you know, y'all be just worried and concerned and then trying to, oh man, let me give it some time and try to reel her back in and all this other stuff. Hold on one second. And I'm saying to a lot of you dudes like this, man, why the hell do you care? Right? Especially too, when, I, you know, <laughs> I can tell sometimes a woman just, just disrespect them. <laughs> and, <laughs> and and then like he, he be begging her back because why because a lot of men like i say in early videos shoot lack lack the uh respect you know what i'm saying lack respect and have you know shout out to mystic on this one man <laughs> You have that one itis disease. You have the you have the disease of this is the best girl ever. She's got this is the cute this is the best one I'm ever gonna get. This she's like she's still bad, still got that cute face, got that booty behind her, and I don't think I can get anything better than that for the next six months. You probably next two years. That's what a lot of you dudes have. It's that one itis disease, man, and it's just like, damn, like that. That's really bad, man. That that's that's the real prick big problem with a lot of these dudes, man. And then you be, and then you want to like talk to her over and over again. He's like, oh, we we could be cool, we could be cordial, we can do this. Why would you do that, man? The woman already disrespected you. <laughs> Shoot, why would you do that? Especially, too, a lot of you dudes won't be in the wrong. Or a lot of you dudes get into a little little stupid disagreement with them and take it to a whole nother level. Like, man, one homie, man. <laughs> I'm going to put out a couple examples of this one. One homie, you know, he's still tripping over one female. Like, oh, we ain't cool like that. I'm like, man, shoot, don't worry about it. <laughs> And I really wanted to tell him too. You know you got rent to pay. And I always say it like this. Forget the money and all that other stuff, but shit, you can go out here and get another bad chick. <laughs> you know, but a lot of guys, man, they, they wanna wait until like, dang man, she getting dug out by somebody else. She having fun with a whole nother dude. You get mad and upset by it, and it's just like, man, forget it. And the chick, uh, the dude was talking about. <laughs> That's the crazy thing. She, she, you know, she, she, her body cold and everything. Them yeek, them yeeks hanging out. But I, I, when I first seen her, first viewed her, I was like, man, this girl a goofball. <laughs> I'd be like, why, why, why do we be tripping over this nonsense? <laughs> <laughs> really? Why why do be tripping over over goofy women? Really don't make no sense. I would not have I got some time to make more more content for the video. But yeah, man, it's just it's really retarded, man. <laughs> and then you, you wanna beg them back, man. You, you, oh man, I, I shoot, yeah, I like her, I like her a lot, man. Who the hell cares? <laughs> This is how you don't even have confidence for yourself. Shoot, I remember times when like women disrespected me or leave me, and I wasn't even on this level of thinking of like, yeah, she can be hanging out with another dude or anything like that. But 
my mindset personally was shoot i cannot oh hold on this person need to hurry up and leave so i get this coffee my mindset was with it was like hey i you know <laughs> you can talk all you want but i got college work to do i just wish i just felt uh, went through it the whole thing but that was me I gotta go to college, man. Or my thing too. I remember an ex uh, a couple years ago. She called me at <laughs> she called me at my job. I was about to start, and the crazy thing was, she was like, "Hey, can we talk?" And all this other crap. I was like, "Yeah, just call me on my break because I work in the overnight shift." And when it came to my first break, you know. I was like, I don't even care. I just want to play Subway Surfers. <laughs> really, man, that's really it. And I'm going to say it like this, too. You know, she bad. She Back then, she was beautiful, you know. She was a beautiful girl, like, you know. But it was just two things. We were just fighting way too much. And on top of that, too, she was transferring to a whole different college. So it was like, what, what's the point of me having a conversation with a female for? Even with women that, you know, didn't even go out of state or go to a different college. I was just like, <laughs> I don't know what you want me to do. <laughs> I was, you know, I was hurt that, you know, the breakup happened because I don't sit up here. Oh, I don't feel anything and this, that and the third. That's what y'all, that's what y'all, a lot of y'all YouTubers will be making this content. Y'all be capping, bro. Oh, I don't, I'll be hurt. I was hurt and all this other stuff. Yeah, I was hurt. I was, I was upset. I was sad that, you know, the relationship ended because back then I really did love the women that I was dating. Shout out to y'all. But, you know, I was just like, you know, just keep your distance and just, just work. And my thing was like this, buy some new clothes, <laughs> Shoot. buy some new clothes, man. <laughs> but, you know, a lot of you dudes, y'all be just upset bagging the woman back man i'll be like man what's wrong with y'all man over some booty <laughs> shoot that's probably already getting dug out by somebody else come on man shoot. she talking to a whole nother dude who probably dusty and y'all y'all be tripping over uh, uh chicks that have three or four dna in them what come on man Man, y'all crazy. Hey, man. You know, guys, man, y'all got to have the strength and let her know that, you know, you willing to walk away from the female, man. Shoot. I wouldn't be tripping over that. You know, now if now I'm going to say it like this, and I think I said it earlier in the video. Now, if it's, it's a fight. Yeah, happy where she didn't cheat on you. She just angry about it and whatever. And, you know, like I tell guys, you got to know your female. You know, she wouldn't step out on you with another dude within the time span of two weeks. Then, you know, y'all can just get back together. But like I always say, she must she must respect you. Forget all that submitting crap. I mean, that's true. But forget all that submitting crap. It's really about that respect level. You know, because women will never apologize for their dumb decisions that they make. But when you begging her back and now she clowning you in front of her friends and they're probably that male best friend where who be just, you know, laying it down right. And you you still tripping off it, bro. Like, ain't no respect level in that. None whatsoever. You know, that's why a lot of you dudes are getting frustrated. That's why a lot of you dudes. Uh, like I said, disrespect. Don't ever do that, man. Don't don't allow this goofy woman to disrespect you in, in any shape or way or form. Like I always say, man, you know, women have the power to choose who they want and they what dudes they want in their life. But I always say it like this. You have the, the control of the dynamic. And this is why I say, you know, strength is everything. Confidence is everything. Shoot, even like when you're talking to a man and they start giving out red flags, you know, the average dude, he just goes, 
oh man, I could work through that, get with her. You begging her back because it, it's so good. <laughs> like, come on, man, that's, that's that's ridiculous in my opinion. Shoot, there's other women who probably who probably got that good good, and and who probably are respectful towards you. Don't ever be just begging them back, especially too, man. Like. Why you even keep their number, man? Because because when you sit, like this is what's gonna happen to most of the guys, right? In two to three days, five days, man, you you having a good time, you you you're finally getting a good workout in X, Y, and Z. You hanging with the homies, you know, you're doing your job right for once, and then you let this woman come back and play and play games and fiddle with you and all this other crap. You look like a fool. Then you back in your emotions again. And everybody's like, yo, you was just good. You was in good spirits before. Oh, yeah, me and my ex, she's starting stupid stuff again. Like, come on, bro. That's what you get for begging her back. Be smart. Mouth.